the josa counseling is a few days away and uh, there is a lot of interest among students and parents with regard to csc cutoffs in both the iits as well as the nits we've done a previous video for uh, csc cutoffs in all categories across all the 23 iits following request from students and parents we are doing this video today for the csc cutoffs at the top 10 nits and uh, how did i consider this top 10 nits i just looked at the closing ranks of csc in the open category and based on that i sorted and normally these are accepted to be the top 10 nits okay nirf ranking and other things may tell you a different story but this reflects the popular perception and these are the closing ranks as of uh, the sixth round 2021 last year closing rank sixth round okay so just let's look at the the cutoffs for the top 10 nits and here as far as nits are concerned as opposed to iits there are two two types of quotas basically one is the home state hs the other is the other state os now what is this home state and what is the other state wherever you have done your 12th class you will be considered in the home state category in that particular state like for example you have done your 12th class or inter intermediate as it is called in say telangana so warangal at NIT, uh, NIT Warangal, you will be considered in the home state category. For every other NIT, Trichy, Suratkal, Raurkela, every other NIT, you will be considered in the other state category. So, 50% of the seats are reserved for home state, 50% of the seats are reserved for other state candidates. Normally, the home state competition will vary from state to state. For example, Rajasthan is ultra competitive. Similarly, Telangana is ultra competitive. So, there are a few states where there is a lot of competition even in the home state. But there are states, for example, Tamil Nadu, not very competitive. So, in those, ca in those cases, in the home state category, the computer science cutoff will be much, much lower as compared to other NITs. So, we will see that difference here today. Let us start with NIT Trichy. In the case of other state, in open category, okay. Now let me explain this. There are two category. There are two categories in each of these uh, quotas. In the case of open quota, there is gender neutral and female. Now gender neutral means both boys and girls will be considered. Female is exclusively for females. Okay. By creating this additional supernumerary seats, you get this female quota. So. In the case of Trichy, in the gender neutral category, other state, the cutoff last year was 714. And in the case of females, it is 1045. Similarly, EWS 129, 306, OBC 369, 361, SC 150, 168, ST 47 and 59. Okay. I am basically focusing on other state because other state will tell you the nature of competition all India. As I explained earlier, home state competition will vary from state to state. Okay. Now let us look at Suratkal. Suratkal, other state, gender neutral, last year's cutoff was 111, so 1111. And in the case of female, it was 1688. The other things are obvious. Okay. So, what you can do is you can take a screenshot of this for later reference. Uh, this has, this table has the um, cutoffs for all categories for the top five NITs, which are the ones we already discussed Trichy. Next is Suratkal. Next is Warangal. In the case of Warangal, let us look at both home state as well as other state. In the case of other state, it is 1520 gender neutral and female is 2365 
in the open category. In the case of home state, that means if you belong to the state of Telangana, that means if you have done your 12th class or intermediate from the state of Telangana, then you will be considered in the home state category for Warangal and in which case the cutoff is 3089 gender neutral, 3773 female in the open category. In the EWS category, it is 587, 634, 1264, 1983, 496, 972, 94, 205 in the case of ST. Okay. In the case of Raurkela, the other state category, gender neutral 2327 and female 3861 in the open quota. Alabad, Alabad, NIT Alabad, open uh, other state 2751 in the case of gender neutral, 5314 in the case of females. Uh, the other categories is all given here, EWS, OBC, SC, ST. So, the top 5 NITs are Trichy, Suratkal, Varangal, Raurkela and Alabad. Now, let us look at the next 5, 6 to 10, which are they? Jaipur, Calicut, Nagpur, Surat, Kurukshetra. In the previous uh, slide, you would have uh, noticed, uh, let us take Trichy. Home state cutoff was 5659, other state cutoff was 714. See the difference? Huge difference because in the state of Tamil Nadu, the local competition is not very much. Let us look at, say, for example, Warangal. In the, if you look at Warangal, uh, 1520 In the case of Raurkela, again, there is a huge difference. 2327, other state. Home state is 9349. So, again in Orissa, in the home state category, it is not very, very competitive. So, even at 9349 in the open category, you will get a seat in computer science. Okay. Now, let us go on. Jaipur, Rajasthan again is another ultra competitive state. So, in Jaipur, for example, home state is 3816. Other state is 3142, not too much of difference there. Okay, let us go on. Calicut, again, if you see Calicut, there is a huge difference because Kerala by itself is not very competitive. Other state is 3436, home state is 10297. Okay, Nagpur, 5838, home state, other state 4751. Surat, home state 7579, other state 5337. Kurukshetra, other uh, home state 6887, other state 5976. The other categories is also given EWS, OBC, SC, ST. You can take a screenshot of this. All right. Uh, this will give you the top cutoffs for CSE for the top 10 NITs. Uh, if there are any questions in this regard, you can uh, post it in our comment section and we will come back to you. Also, there is a, uh, there are, there is a section of students who are not happy with their uh, showing in both JE main as well as JE advanced. For all such students, um, there is hope because uh, uh, you can always repeat and uh, last two years we understand because of Corona, students could not concentrate well also. Uh, the online classes are no substitute for physical classes in some states and some uh, institutes. The online classes were not held so very well. So, some students genuinely suffered. If you think you have got the potential and uh, you have not done well at JE main or JE advanced or both, I think you will not lose much by repeating. So, instead of uh, compromising on whatever you get, you can always try and JE main and JE advance for the next season uh, is not very far away. Both the exams are not very far away. JE main may be held end of January, first week of February, the first session, the second session will be held sometime in April and JE advanced as usual will be held in May. So, in a matter of few months from now, if you continue the same momentum of preparation, 
you may be well prepared for 2023. And uh, compared to the students who are getting into IITs and NITs, you will not be losing much because these students, you as you as you know, the counseling is yet to start and the counseling will go on till October, uh, mid or uh, end of October. The colleges will start only by 1st of November. They will have a very truncated first year. So compared to them, if you join uh, IITs and NITs in 2023, you are going to have full one year. So for all those students who are looking at um, repeating the course, we at Nano My Classroom uh, have a very, very focused and structured program to take you through the preparation for the next few months. Um, we have uh, three branches in the Telugu speaking states, Nallakunta and Madhapur in Hyderabad. These are our numbers. And in Vizag, this is our number, 9164062062. We have hostels for both boys and girls at all the three places. So if you don't stay uh, at these locations, you can always stay in the hostel. You can call these numbers to get more details. Okay. So any questions on cutoffs and uh, JOSA counseling? We'll be glad. Our team will be glad to answer. Just put it in our comment section, and we'll come back to you. Um, we will, uh, based on your queries and your feedback, we will come back with. Uh, other interesting information as far as your JOSA counseling is concerned. So till that time, all the best for your JOSA counseling.